So as part of our trip out on this NERC summer school, we've brought the students to this, this radar installation. Um, it's called Duga 3, or uh, also known as Chernobyl 2. And this radar installation was built um, for use during the time of the Cold War to be able to monitor the pathway of ballistic missiles should they be fired over from America through to, to the, the Soviet Union. Um, obviously, since the time of the reactor, this whole area has, has been abandoned, so the, the reactor disaster created this exclusion zone. We now get to come to a radar station which has been left unadulterated and is still an absolutely amazing sight. So if we look up here, you can just see the structures heading up into the sky. And as an engineering feat, it is truly amazing. We've, we've been really privileged over the course of this summer school to already go and see the Chernobyl nuclear power plant up close, to see the new safe confinement up close, and now to come and see Duga 3. And as I work in the Chernobyl exclusion zone, I often see as I'm undertaking my field sampling work, this installation projecting up over the tree line there are a couple of things about the Chernobyl skyline that really stand out. One is the new safe confinement facility, that Chernobyl arch as it's known, and the other one is Duga 3. So it's really great to finally make it here and get to see what this installation looks like up close and personal. Is it doing video or? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hey, Mom. Really yeah. What's your first impressions of this? It's pretty big. It's Soviet crazy. Yeah. So cool. I'm in the wrong science. I should be in nuclear defense. Clearly. <laughs> no, I'm all about safety. That's that's more fun. Safety is fun, guys. <laughs> Can you imagine the view from the top? That's what we're saying. Before. Yeah. Imagine how far you'd be able to see. Mm. Be incredible. I imagine you can see Chernobyl itself. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It could look quite green. Yeah, it'd be a lot of trees. A lot of trees. If, yeah. if, if this was in yeah. England, so the first summer people would spot it more. It would be like a. It would be a theme. Yeah. Do they try? Do they try? Yeah, you would. Do they just you know, shoot their own How far are we now from the power plant? I think we maybe 15 or 20 kilometers. So if you're up there, you could see yes. when it happened. Yes. Right. Okay. So wow. if you take, if, 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 if you go with this ladder mm -hmm. on the top, you can see the power plant. Oh wow! So you have a clear view of it. What are your thoughts on this uh, on this structure? What do you think, Alex? Oh, it's pretty, uh, pretty magnificent, isn't it? Pretty it's beautiful in its own way. Yeah. yeah. Strangely beautiful. Yeah, I know. I've never really uh, seen anything like it before, to be honest. It's really impressive. I just want to get up that ladder, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> to give you just a I want to get hands on with it. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> Can we just have you the lift? Oh yeah, look, is that a lift? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There, there you go. Is the express. Yeah. Uh, Express ride to the top. Now, would you be brave enough? No one's afraid no. of heights, are they? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, are you? Man, <laughs> man, heights, I am. Yeah. Do you not? Uh, I'd want to see how tight they are. Do you not think this one's really safe then to be around? Or I mean, it's stood here for quite a long time and pretty stable, isn't it? So it's probably fine. Okay. And he said it's as big underground as it is yeah. up here, which is uh, pretty, pre big. pretty amazing. So our guide was saying that we could, uh, you can see the power plant from the top oh, quite yeah. easily. You can so see anything from the top of it. So can you imagine <laughs> being at the top <laughs> when uh, the disaster <laughs> happened? Imagine the oh, helicopters right. flying around. <laughs> what have you found? That is pretty heavy. It's, good noise. No. it's pretty. It's pretty heavy. That's um, that's fallen from somewhere. Yeah. Oh, God, don't tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I love how this is a joke. <laughs> 